world. Welcome to Board System Test 74, so let's go ahead and get started. For our first notification appliance, we have a Simplex 4903-9215, and this device is a mechanical device, as well as this device will be doing march time. Over here, we have a first alert, um, SA304, and we will be testing this today with some smoke, um, with my fake smoke. Over here, we have an FOS 6226-W, and this device will be doing temporal three. Up here, we still have the Simplex 2098-986 test switch. Below the test switch, we have two pull stations. On the left, we have a Federal Signal 4050-211T, and on the right, we have a Simplex 4251-20. Below the pull stations, we have a System Center RTS2 key test switch, which I will not be testing today. Below the test switch, we have a System Center D4120, which I will not be testing today. To start off today's test, I'm going to pull the Simplex 4251-20. Here we go. Three, two, one. And the alarm is silent. Now I'll go ahead and test the smoke detector by just spraying some smoke. So here we go. As you can see, the escape light turned on. We are now going to reset this pool station. So all you do is you insert your key, you turn it, you open the station back up, and the handle flips up automatically. You close it back into place, lock it back up. And now we'll go into our main firearm control panel, and we are going to hit system reset. Really quickly, I'm going to go ahead and activate the Simplex key switch. So I'm going to insert my key, and I'm going to turn to test. So here we go. With testing the test station out of the way, I'm now going to flip the switch back to normal. As you can see right there, take my key out, and I'm now going to go into our main firearm control panel, and I'm going to hit system reset. To finish off today's test, I'm going to pull the federal signal pull station. So here we go. Three, two, one. Okay, so since this pool station is pretty hard to reset while holding the camera, I'm going to do it by a tripod. So all I'm going to do is I'm going to insert my key right here, or not insert my key, I'm going to insert my screwdriver right here. And the station will open up. And as you can see, the switch is still up. So I can just go ahead and reset it. And we're going to tighten the screw back up. tightened up just like that and we're now going to go ahead and reset the main firearm control panel i am now going to reset the main firearm control panel it will reset and there we are all right guys i thank you for watching this video be sure to rate comment and subscribe and have a great day and i'll see you guys in the next video goodbye Thank you.